Hi, welcome to Heartwood Rocking Horses. My goal is to raise $1,500 to take my rocking horses to the Piedmont Craftsman Crafts Fair this November. I'm gonna show you a few of my rocking horses and tell you a little bit about my journey as a rocking horse maker and let you know why it's so important to me to be able to go to an art show like the Piedmont Craftsman Fair. I've always been interested in horses and drawing since I was a young kid. I never would have guessed though that drawing horses would later become the foundation of a rocking horse business. I started my interest in building things while working for Habitat for Humanity in Durham, North Carolina. I was on the construction team for four years and became really comfortable with the power tools and with structural design ideas. I ended up taking a few woodworking classes on the side just for fun, and I was really drawn to the details of the woodworking. I made my first simple rocking horse at a class there. I gave it to my niece, and after watching her just explode with joy, riding her horse, talking to it, petting it, feeding it, I could see that kids' imaginations could really create worlds of adventure with these horses. I decided I really wanted to try doing this for a living, creating hand-carved wooden rocking horses that would last for generations, spark creativity and joy in kids, and be a beautiful work of art. <clears throat> I might seem a little big for this rocking horse, and you would be right, but I wanted to show you that these horses are fully functional. They're very sturdy, and they should be able to be passed down for generations. I make each horse myself, starting with a small drawing, bringing that up to scale, and designing how all the parts will fit together. I carve everything with a mallet and chisel and with a power carver. I sand everything with a power sander and finish sanding by hand and everything is finished with a oil and wax finish that is non-toxic, non-petroleum based and child safe. Some people believe that the horses are just decorative but they're made to be ridden like the wind. I do make some <clears throat> sculptural horses that are decorative and I also make some custom horse portrait carvings and custom horse heads or full body custom horse statues. So here's why I'm asking for help on Kickstarter. My business is still somewhat new and most of the money I have saved up from selling horses has gone into new tools, lumber, sandpaper, just getting started. Right now I mostly work order to order and with each order paying for itself as it comes in. <clears throat> it makes it really hard for me to build up a large inventory of horses to take to an art show. These art shows are really important to me. They broaden my audience and they get my horses out into the world. They allow me to meet other successful artists and to share ideas and get inspiration from them. I get to make new connections and make new orders for the future. Plus, usually I'm just working alone in my garage, carving away all alone, and I can feel really isolated and insignificant. The shows allow me, allow me to get out and be around other people. I can see their reactions and hear the wows when they see my rocking horses. And I get to find out what people relate to and what they really connect with. It really helps keep me motivated on the lonely days in the shop and it's something I look forward to all year. The shows carry a lot of upfront costs though. As I mentioned, I have to make a bunch of horses up front and pay for all those materials myself. Then there's an the entry fee, which is over $600 for this show. I have to rent a U-Haul to bring all the stuff to the show. There's food, lodging, printing business cards. The list can really just go on and on. Hopefully the show is a great success and I can make up all those costs after the fact. That's why I'm asking you for help. If you can help me cover these upfront costs, Hopefully I can have a successful show and start to save up cash for the next event. This $1,500 cost I'm shooting for is an estimate that should cover the basic stuff that I've mentioned, plus this campaign. Anything above and beyond that would help me update my booth. People really spend thousands of dollars on their booth displays, and the good ones really stand out and make a big impact on customers. Thanks so much for listening to my story. I hope you are convinced of how important this show is to me, and I really appreciate anything you can do to help. 
Thanks so much, and I appreciate you being here.